In order to ensure that the patient is safe during anesthesia, we have to have monitoring uh, in anesthesia, and basically we have to monitor nine variables uh, continuously. These nine variables consist of five uh, uh, for device monitoring and four for patient monitoring. If you look at the device monitoring, we have to monitor all the parameters that can cause uh, uh, any harm to the patient, like oxygen concentration, uh, carbon dioxide concentration, anesthetic agent concentration, uh, pressure and flow rate and basically from the flow rate we can integrate to get the volume of the breathing uh, air okay and basically uh, uh, for the patient monitoring we have to monitor mainly for signals uh, uh, electrocardiogram a non-invasive blood pressure oxygen saturation and the body temperature and basically uh, uh, for uh, regular uh, or for advanced modern uh, anesthesia machines like this, usually you will have a screen that has the patient monitoring and another for the uh, device monitoring. Sometimes you can get both on the same screen like this, but uh, uh, it's very important for the anesthesiologist to monitor all these parameters so that he uh, can notice uh, uh, any changes that uh, happen during the surgery and basically uh, make sure that the, uh, uh, that the patient is safe. 